The technical term is piggybacking. Someone without a key waits for another person to open the door for them. With no front desk and no security officer, there is nobody to catch an intruder. And it has been a concern of mine because we're in a city and it's pretty easy to just follow people in when they swipe in, but we haven't had problems with it before. Most of the GW dorms are like this, apartment style, where you need a key card or a friend to let you in. It's not the tightest security, but some say it's convenient. Obviously, some, every once in a while, somebody crazy is going to get in, but it's also nice when your friends are coming in to not have to sign them in, so I actually kind of like it. Here at AU, all dorms have a desk attendant who checks any student who wants to get into the building. They might complain or whine, but when it comes down to it, it's for their safety. And that's not all. In McDowell Hall, AU added new security over the summer. Where you swipe into the door, and then you have to swipe to get into the stairwell and into the elevator, to use the elevator. Back at GW, the students still feel safe, even without any strict security. Yeah, it would probably be safer, but I just feel like this is such a good neighborhood anyway that it doesn't really bother me. 